my husband was out jogging and we couldn't find him. So our daughter called St. Agnes and they said, yes, we picked up a gentleman. He was uh, jogging. We had to resuscitate him. You need to come immediately. So that started our journey. By the time I got here, they had already put in a stent. Um, he was, of course, on a ventilator and they were taking him in for a CAT scan because he fell so hard. They wanted to make sure that there was no blood clot or damage to the brain. Dr. Singh came in and said, we have a new procedure here. We would like to try this on your husband. They apparently had had me in therapeutic hypothermia, a new protocol here at St. Agnes that had just been brought in the month before in December. From the time we walked in the door, uh, we had excellent care. The staff was very open. They were very uh, communicative. They explained everything that was happening. The nurses from um, the, the head nurse on the floor to you know, just the, the nurses coming in, they were wonderful. They talked to Scott just as if he were awake. When I came out, uh, my family was telling me a lot of things. Uh, I knew visitors were left being allowed to come in some. I heard my family had spent the week camped out in the cardio, cardiac intensive care unit waiting room. My son had had his 35th birthday party in there. Once they brought Scott out of the coma, Dr. Tallis wanted him to start walking. And so um, Scott was bound and determined he was going to get up and get out of there. When it was time to go to the, the next floor, he walked rather than take a wheelchair. And they all applauded him. We all know the doctors are tremendous. They're, they're trained for a dozen years or something to, to do their job, and they come in, they do it, they do it great. But the nurses and the staff are there 24-7. They've got to take care of you. They've got to monitor. They've got to know what's going on and know how to react. And the nurse is, is kind of a friend for a while. Uh, he or she is somebody that you, you, you want to see, you feel good about. You're happy that when you hit that little red button, they react. From first week of February or so till late June, I was in uh, cardio rehab, and same thing there. That three days a week going in there, it, uh, you, you, once again, you're getting big smiles from people that care, and they're under a lot of strain. Uh, not everybody makes it. And I've had a few surgeries here, and a few other procedures and things done here, and uh, they all react pay attention, communicate, and, and do it with a, a smile or compassion. You can tell they, they love what they're doing and it comes through.